Get full access to our 10,000 episodes with your paid subscription. My Outdoor TV. Start your free trial today. This time of the year means for us. Oh, you don't know? Well, I'm about to show you. Well, Muddy products make these prefab platforms. My idea, I've got several of these. So I put the floor in, screwed it to the metal frame of the tower, and I'm kind of putting a skirting up around. You're hidden, you're hidden. He's coming in, he's on the trail. You can still step up shoot from zero to 100 yards with your bow if you want to. So I'll lay down a couple stall mats, make a rubber floor, dress up the outside, and we'll have a tower out in the middle of the CRP field. We're getting deer hunting on our mind. We're doing some scouting, but first we've got to finish up food plots. We've got still yard work. We've got a little bit of cattle work to do. Uh, we're, the winter wheat's going in the ground. We're cutting this, swapping that, planting that, mowing this. This spot's been a year in the making, at least. Probably more like 18 months. As you can tell, it's just a jungle, thick, just deadfalls and underbrush and poison ivy. We never even got to hunt this into the property last year because it just wasn't ready. It just, it just wasn't ready. So, it's ready now. I've got all the water stations in place, the feeders, the food plots are coming on. Um, I had two or three properties where I'd see groups of bucks, a dozen bucks, 15, 17, 19 bucks in a, in a group that they'd find these little pockets that I'd create for them and, and plant the plots for them and then get them all set up and just leave them alone. You know, it starts building that fire in me to, to get out and get some deer on, on film and just do some general preseason scouting. Part of the preseason scouting can be trail cameras. It can be just going out with good optics and grabbing a hilltop just to watch and see how they're moving in and out of the feed fields. Probably the most important piece of equipment I've got that I use pretty much year round are optics. Good optics are just so crucial. It takes months in advance to get ready for opening day, for sure. Do you know what it's like to sit in one of those fiberglass boxes with 118 heat index outside and about 140 inside. That, the inside of that shooting house by the time I left smelled like the world's largest dirty sock. And it was all because of me. So I hope the deer come back. We hope you've enjoyed this free episode. To continue watching, start your free trial now.